when we talk about Never Pray Again, um, one of the questions that people periodically ask is, how can you be Christian? Or if they want to be confrontational, they'll say, how can you call yourselves Christian? How can you be Christian if you don't pray? Um, because prayer is probably the most common spiritual practice among Christians. Uh, for Protestants, it's kind of on a short list of spiritual practices. It's kind of our fault um, in, uh, in, in throwing off Catholicism and rebelling against it. We threw off a lot of practices that maybe have a lot of value, um, leaving very few practices behind. Usually, uh, if you ask someone, what does a Christian life look like? Uh, it's praying and reading the Bible and then kind of a shrug, maybe fasting if you're really uh, devoted. Um, but there isn't a lot there. Uh, and it's interesting that prayer is considered core to the Christian life and not other things. So why, why is it impossible to be a Christian and not pray, but it's possible to be a Christian and not give away all your wealth? Or it's possible to be a Christian and not give things away to everyone who asks you? Or it, it's, it's supposedly possible to be a Christian uh, and not reconcile on your way to court? Or, um, you know, to allow the sun to set on your anger with another person. Maybe we like prayer as a spiritual practice because it demands so little of us. It's kind of the easy way out. Um, in fact, you know, one of the questions we bring up in the book, and it's a live question for me, is maybe we're better Christians if we don't pray. Uh... You know, how can, how can a person be Christian, call themselves Christian? Uh, how can a person be Christian and pray all the time? How can someone be Christian and pray that God forgives rather than forgiving or, or seeking to reconcile? How can someone be Christian and pray for God to intervene rather than intervening and doing something? Uh, how can someone be Christian and pray that God would bless someone rather than blessing them? themselves? How can someone be Christian and pray uh, thanksgiving to God while hoarding their possessions and, and coveting more and living a thankless life? Um, anyway, those are the, the kinds of questions that we talk about uh, in our book. And, um, and to the question, how can you be Christian and not pray? Uh, I think we might respond, how can you be Christian and pray? Perhaps there's more you could be doing. Oh, Steve.